Alcohol is known to act as a social lubricant and is usually used as a nice way to unwind with a group of friends. Especially students like to experiment with alcohol during their college years. But what happens once that beer works its way through your bloodstream? The principal type of alcohol found in alcoholic beverages is ethanol. Ethanol is produced using the process called fermentation where yeasts break down sugar into alcohol and carbon dioxide. After consummation, ethanol passes from the stomach into the small intestine where it is rapidly absorbed into the blood and spread throughout the body. Ethanol is able to pass through the blood-brain barrier, affecting nerve cells directly by altering levels of neurotransmitters. This results in changes in behavior. Ethanol is able to affect both excitatory and inhibitory neurotransmitters. Excitatory neurons use glutamate, while inhibitory neurons use GABA. Glutamate normally increases brain activity and energy levels, whereas GABA does the opposite. Alcohol affects these two signals by inhibiting glutamate transmission and enhancing GABA transmission, resulting in a low information flow. A slow information flow can lead to a loss of coordination, slowed reflexes, altered speech, dulled hearing, impaired vision, and makes it harder to think clearly. Ethanol does not only affect the brain. Heavy drinking can cause high blood pressure and your heart to beat abnormally. Ethanol can also scar and damage the liver, cause inflammation of the pancreas, and disturb the regulation of electrolytes by the kidneys. It can even weaken your libido. A seemingly innocent night drinking with some friends can end up in a morning from hell. We all know what we're talking about. A hangover. The severity of a hangover varies from person to person and is closely linked to how much alcohol was consumed. Because of alcohol's diuretic effect on the body, Excessive intake of alcohol increases urine production, which explains why you keep running to the bathroom all night. As a result, you will become dehydrated, which is possibly one of the causes of your hangover symptoms, which include tiredness, a headache, and nausea. So with all the negative effects alcohol has on the body, in the future, replace your glass of wine with a soft drink. Okay, that was a joke. But remember, drink responsibly. So, cheers!